guys and welcome to this video. In this video I'll be talking about the new player of the month Mohamed Salah and what I think I am selling. This will be great as you can see there's a lot of stuff requirements and a lot of prices have gone up. So for instance the native warrior in from Syria which I invest in for Christmas. So a lot of Christmas investments and A4s and A3s from Syria or any A4s and A3s in general have gone up slightly and a lot of them have gone up by mad money and there's one player which I have made 35k on on one player on one player on my, even if that's a special card that is mad money like stupid money so as you can see a informed Siri it's now touching around about 30 uh, 4750 which is you know really really good all right I'm gonna be talking about stuff what to do and what not to do uh, during the, the play month I'm in Salah and obviously Christmas uh, period of time. So as you can see I'll be listing up a lot of these A4 rate informs that are going for a lot more than they should be. So Syria cards going about 34k. So we've got Jekko here which is going for a bit more. But dur during this sort of time I would sell all the screaming cards you've got at the moment. I would sell all the one watches apart from the two which I'll be showing you in a minute. I would sell all your screen cards because literally the screen cards have gone up by so much money. It's unbelievable. <laughs> Sorry about that. And I would also um, sell a purple card, all your purple cards, because especially one particular, if you have picked him up for about 15k you could have at the time, because he is, you know, he, he has gone up a lot. Anyway, we're selling on our Jack and we're selling on our Akadi, but I'm going to tell you what I recommend it not to do at the moment. So there's people, there's informs, the 84 rate informs. I would only really sell the ones from the leagues, so like the likes of the Calcio A. I wouldn't really sell the others, even though they have gone up to about 30,000 coins. The other informs, may, maybe something about 28, 29, which I'll show you. Uh, I'll show you one of, one of the examples later. But I honestly think in the Christmas petite, they, they will go up a, a little bit more. Bear in mind, you need them probably going to be needing 8.4s and 8.3 informs a lot but anyway what you can do during this sort of time is invest in more team and group stage players and more loads of loads of high rate players so you need to, you're, what you need to do is keep your 83s and 84s I would say that aren't part of the Calcio because honestly, I, don't, I don't think they I think that they might probably go up by a K or two, a K maybe a slightly more but I'd obviously hang on to them and sell them on um, during the Christmas time. But sell your eighth, um, I think eight three rate uh, and eight four rate, but eight no sorry eight four rate players in front of Calcio now and your eight four in front of Calcio now. Don't sell these eight four as you can see quite a lot. Of, all these players have sold fifty k straight in the bank. Easy as that. But I wouldn't say sell your. Um, 84 rate informs that you invest in from random leagues yet. But the fact is, there's still a chance that I could even raise a bit more than the 30k. If I wanted to, I could sell this iron for 30,000 coins and make 7 8, 8, 7 to 8,000 hours on coins more profit. So about this noise. But I honestly, I don't, I don't think you want to do that. But the fact is, for instance, smart is about 37.50, I've run about 24, 25k, could be an extra 5k profit. I'm not going to do that because I honestly think they could price about 40 to 45k, maybe even 50k potentially. Um, uh, do you know what I'm saying? All these players are around about 30 to 30, 31,000 coins at the moment. So, as you can see, I'm already in profit about 6 or 7k, maybe after tax 4 or 5, but still, I'm not going to sell them all now. These players, however, I am going to sell them because I've, I'm making a hell of a lot on these screen cards and it's just unbelievable. But what I did after this is I knew um, going and borrow, buying a couple more high rated players like the likes of Luka Modric, who I paid 47k, um, uh, PK 28k, uh, Iniesta 27, and a couple more high rate players who I can't remember the top of my head. But the fact is, there's going to be new prime icons SBCs during this SP during this period, and the the play the price price is still quite down. For instance, Buffon's like 49k, 
You can get Mudra for 47k, he's 89 right, and that's a mad deal. Which is unbelievable, I actually got one bid for that, which is just stupid. So, all, the, all those players, definitely recommend you invest in anyone above the 87 right period, 88, 89s, 90s. For instance, Higuain Cruz would be a good example, if they're about 60,000 coins for a 90 right player, if needed in the prime, obviously. It's going to be a really, really big prime market, as we see, which is just uh, bumping the price up. As you can see, that boss was about 28,000 coins. So I can end up listing that Fraser Foster card up for 13, for over double what I paid, which is just mental. Same with that Van Damme, that Van Damme is now 23.5k, I only paid 12k for him. Which is, you know, it, it's insane. This is on the card, 26k, uh, being a start there. I'm going to choose 26500, I think I end up selling him on for about 26750 for some reason. Thanks to you for that, right? but he ended up did send him on after this video which is very really, really nice so I get a little bit extra amount of coins but you know the, the amount of profit I make just because of this player in my experience of rain so I want to set ones again so your screen cards your purple cards uh, and your one to watch cards apart from two which obviously I'll be showing you uh, sell your calcio a a four eight informs any calcio a a four eight players do not sell any other a four eight informs and do not sell any other it's for these eight fours, eight five rate players, because they will probably go up more when the start of Christmas players come out. Uh, and yeah, that's pretty much um, it. Also, definitely invest in more of the high rated players uh, at the moment, because all those players are really, really cheap. Like cheap for who they are. The eight, eight sevens, eighty eight, eighty nines, and nineties. They only stick to the eighty eights, eight all those players. Sorry. And now we're about to show you the mad profit. So this is Grant's card, card, 16 and a half k paid. I don't know if you saw that, but you know, and look, he's literally 48,000 coins. And I think at the moment he's now, like, they're gonna, going to go extinct. So his price may even risen. So it may not even be a good job to go and sell him now. But I, I wanted the money, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> this is still like four or five, I think it's four times the amount of profit I paid for him. Paid 16 double that, blah blah blah. No, three, three and a half times as much I paid for him. I'm just going up, checking checking what he's actually going for. Look, more than 48,250. And I paid 16k for that card. Like, that's 32,000 or something um, in profit on one card. It's just mental. So, that's one card I am selling on uh, in this because, you know, 16 half k, 47 is stuff, mental. And now we, those two cards there, Kessie and Hannah's, they were going for about 20,000 coins. I don't know if um, I'm going to show it, but they were. But this trial, however, who I paid 17k for, 17 half k even, and as you see, the guy for 40, he sold for 47,000 coins. Making me a very decent profit indeed, but he this trial card was going for a lot. I think Bernadeschi. If you didn't end up, if you did invest in the Bernadeschi, you would have made an absolute ton. I think he's going about 30, 40 thousand coins, which is ridiculous. But you know, this trial card was going up a lot. He went to went to around thirty thousand coins, thirty thousand seven hundred fifty there, and I can now listen up for a double what I paid just under doubled so that is really really nice profit so no it, it, it's just easy so the Hananas and the thing Hananas I paid 15k for went went to about 20k but honestly those two cards will probably go for a little bit more when say you need an SP Christmas SPC with a one to watch by about 8182 rate but 8182 rated but need like a load of different special cards and yeah it's just meant as well as this, I would say invest now a lot of team group stage players because they still are a little they probably have gone up a little bit more because people want to invest in so people will expect those to be in but literally their players are still quite cheap and their prices still be still will be like um, no. so this is Kese cards going for about 20,000 20, so I'm going to quickly change over to here 
this this Kesse card is like is going for about twenty one it's about twenty thousand coins. You can see twenty one K. I put twenty K. I put about fourteen thousand coins so it would only be six K profit, so I'm a key holder then. And just look Hernandez card. I can't spell for some reason. Hernandez and not going left back and um but I look look what I've done. So I not I end up just going left back and French. So I, all I can say from from doing this is sell your eighty four rate Serie A uniforms, sell your eight eighty four rate Serie A players, do not sell your eighty four rate uniforms yet until Christmas, the Christmas SPCs. Do not sell your eighty four and eighty three rate players. Um sell your purple cards because they've gone up like three, four times the profit. Sell your almost green cards. Sell um your oh, I remember, um uh here here are your one switch cards, screen cards, and yeah, you can make tons. That's all from this video. Please like and subscribe around it and I'll speak to you guys later. Bye. And don't forget to buy your high rate players and your Tina Group stage players. That'd be all. Hope you like this video. Please like and subscribe around it and I'll speak to you guys later. Do this, please make money. Bye!